What's going on, everybody? Brian again here with you. Got the remainder of the Obi Olight Summer Sale here. I'm just going to do a kind of a quick and dirty unboxing on these. Um, forgive any background noise that we've got going on. It's uh, still daylight and families, you know, doing their thing. So we're just going to cut into this here. Take a look and see what we got. All right, I got a patch. <laughs> My wife's gonna be happy about that one. Oh, uh, that's awesome. So I got the Olight donut patch, which is really cool. Like I said, my wife's gonna love that. So we'll go ahead and just break into everything here. So we've got the, um, I think it was the midnight, I can't remember how they called it. The, the Midnight Blue Warrior 3, or Warrior Mini 3, sorry. Let's take a look here. Crack into this thing. See how it looks out of the box, shall we? Well, it does come with a little L stand which you can use for storing it of course all the other usual stuff I tell you people give you, know, you hear it in the groups and things all the time people you know talk junk all the time about Oh, they're just doing the same thing. Well, my God, this is a com not a complete redesign, but it is a redesign of the Warrior Mini. But these colorways are just absolutely gorgeous. So you've got a different button versus the Warrior Mini 2 and different tail cap. And the pocket clip is way stronger. Wow, yeah, that's definitely a lot of difference there. And then you do have a different bezel as well. It's really cool there. Uh, we'll go into the pin last. So the freebie for this month, or for this sale, if you were already made an order or anything like that, is you get the IR i1R2 Pro for free. And if it's full free, it's full me. Let's get this thing out of here. Of course, you get your charging cable and everything in the back there with the packaging. We got so many of those at this point. Just takes the standard USB C charger. And you just plug it in. Let's see if it's. Yep, so it's. It works. <clears throat> I'll just tighten these up just to where they're just at the uh, almost ready to open up. It was really cool color coloration. We got the orange pinwheel. Pinwheel pattern always reminds me of the Umbrella Corporation. <laughs> uh, any gaming fans will know what I'm getting there. Let's see this last one, this next one here. Let's see. Well, that's interesting. I they actually put a little film over that. Let's see. I figured there would be some spare stuff in the back of this one okay there's the little <coughs> the little claw <coughs> so this is the new iMini 2 uh, I was actually really interested in the standard iMini um, but I'm not a fan of 
non rechargeable lights in general. So I um I never pulled the trigger on it. Hmm. Does it come with a key ring? Look and see if it has a key ring in this little bag here. Huh. Unless I just missed it, it does not come with a key ring to attach. It has a, a secondary <coughs> or replacement um, little holder there. Hmm. That's mildly disappointing. That's no worries. I've got key rings, so. Um, <clears throat> unless you're just meant to clip this on there and then use this the key ring maybe that's what it or that's probably what they mean you to do as you're probably just meant to use the little carabiner here as a clip on for the light but what really makes this light so special is this little rubber cap covers up the USB charger so you just plug this into a USB slot and this is now a recharging single output pull off man that magnet is really strong too and it's 50 lumens which is a really strong little light for what it is but and I think it has, uh, if I'm not mistaken, the runtime is actually really good on it. Um, yeah. So it'll run at 50 lumens for one hour on a charge. So that for that kind of light, it's really, really, really good. Something so small. <clears throat> but there's that. And then last but not least, we've got the well, the I I mean excuse me the OPN Mini. In brass, so I've had a lot of people. I've heard a lot of people talking about how this is a uh, kind of a game changer for for the OPN let's get this thing out of the box here so you've always got your little thank you card in there um, it's got the information on the in itself so these do come vacuum sealed with a little desiccant pack in there some troll candy <clears throat> Just because it is actually brass it's not a coating it's not a you know it's not painted it's not whatever it is a brass pen let's get that zoom in there and that is absolutely awesome. You got the open mini there and kind of a almost laser engraved in it looks like. Black accents look really good. Get the little rubber or plastic, you know, the little little pen protector, ink protector thing off of there. Yeah, the the weight on this is extremely, extremely good. It is just it. It doesn't feel as I don't know as as doesn't feel as toy like. <laughs> but um, it's awesome because I've actually got two of these on the way. Um, so I've got this one, and then I was uh, I want a drawing for another one. So. I'll have two of these, which is absolutely awesome. And you have the replaceable ink cartridge. Whoa, zoom in. That, 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 there we go. 
Why is it not? There we go. So you do have the replaceable ink cartridges in these. Um, anyway, great little, great little pen. A couple of awesome little keychain lights, and then a really nice everyday light, or uh, you know even a tactical light if in that role if need be. <clears throat> All right, guys. Well, as always, I do appreciate you watching. Um, please like and subscribe if you haven't already. Um, again, you know, as always, I hope you everybody's having a, a safe and great day. And as always, have a nice day. Take care.